Hey, JW is back with you here. Um, this time I'm going to be doing a hike. I'm at Green Lakes State Park today. Um, found this nice, quiet place to do my intro. Um, this lake is Mirio Mictic. I hope I'm saying that right, which means uh, the bottom and the top don't mix during the spring thaw. It's one of the most studied lakes in the country, actually, because of that. Um, the waters are really clear, so it should be pretty cool to look at them. So this first lake we're going to look at is Green Lake. There's also a round lake here. There's two lakes. We're going to look at Green Lake first. Um, I'll walk out from here and I'll show you the beach and everything here in a second. But it's a nice day out. A little cold this morning, but it should warm up. So it should be a nice hike. I don't know if I'm going to do two parts for each lake or not. I might make it all one. I'm not sure yet. So here's the building that I found to do my intro in. Beautiful building. And down here is the beach. I walked across the beach to get up here and my parking's way over that way. And down here is the beginning of the lake. So I'll throw my backpack on here in a second. We'll go down, but we'll look out the other side here first before we hit the trail. The trail's just right down that way. All right, we'll get started here. So here's looking up those stairs up to that building. The start of the trail here. We'll look on down the lake, we'll walk all the way around. Each ancient secret deep in the lake. Green Lake is the most famous example of a six Miriomitic lake in New York State. Most lakes have a seasonal turnover where the top of the, and the lower mix, while a rare metometric lake have stable layers. Only the top layer is mixed. So that's what I was talking about in the intro. This is springtime, so water may not be totally clear, but we'll get a look at it here further down the trail. Pretty cool spot here. See the sand. I think the lake is 300 and some feet deep. At certain spots. There's actually a sign up here. If we walk down here a little bit, it talks about how the light hits it. gives you all the different colors in the lake if you want to pause and read that oh, I 
I'm gonna continue on down and around the lake here. So it says, do you think the top of Dead Man's Point looks like rocks? Many do, but it's actually a living reef. Most of the reefs in green and round lakes are still growing. Small organisms in the water use minerals leached from the bedrock for photosynthesis. So this is actually a reef out here. And we've walked out on this in the summertime. It's like a straight drop off. Here you can get some of the blue tint of the water. Shows up better in the summertime. Another cool little spot here. Beautiful. You guys are just enjoying the lake. You can kayak this lake. You just can't bring your own kayak. You have to rent them from here. And I do believe they have clear bottom ones. Um, they just don't want the lake to get polluted. All right, I'm gonna keep heading around. From back here, you can really see the green color that you get from the lake. turquoise almost you can see what a drop off that is too it's a beautiful walking trail wide it gets really busy here in the summertime so I wanted to do this video now but the lake isn't it's turquoise now, as I thought it might be. So I think what I'll do is I'll come back and do Round Lake, the other lake, more in the summertime. Watch these guys swim away. So this sign here just talks about bacteria and how important it is to the lake. They got benches by all these signs too. You can stop and rest. But this isn't a really long trail, it just goes around the lake. Then right by that sign is this foundation, which I'm not sure what it is. Pretty cool looking though. It's a cool, uh, cool little uh, viewing spot there with the logs. This might be the actual overlook. Yeah, it is, but they consider the overlook here. You can see all the way down to the beach.
So we're halfway around the lake now. So we'll go across this little stretch here together. Around the bridge and then down the home stretch. Then I believe this is how you get to the other lake here. One of the ways. Suns are facing me now. I don't know if you can pick up this reef here. It's pretty cool looking. It sits just below the water. Some more reefs. This is a beautiful section of the trail where I was just filming the lake there. Here's a, another board to read about controlling the erosion around the lake. Try to get it all in there if you can expand it. There's like a little chart thing. And obviously to keep the trails, they gotta decrease the erosion. As you can see the banks here.
thought that was a <clears throat> cool shot there. So thanks for coming along on a little walk around uh, Green Lake here. Um, we'll finish up with a walk along the beach uh, as we get to the parking lot, but just wanted to do my closing remarks here overlooking the lake. So uh, thanks for coming along. Enjoy the little uh, beach walk.